Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today, we are headed out to Target. So come along with us to Target. Let's go. Let's go to Target. Peace. We're at Target. Let's go shopping. I'm going to grab my toothpaste here. It's $4.99. It is a clean toothpaste. Hello toothpaste. Love this toothpaste. They also have Tom's. Tom's is another clean one. Oh, they also have native toothpaste, which is also clean. What's this one? Oh, there she is. There you are. Look. You think you would like this? I saw this one. What is this? Toothpaste, but it's like got good stuff. I, I, I buy the one that we And the uh, paper towel section, like deciding what bounty to get. We ended up with this one. So, yeah. $33.99 or whatever, but you get technically it says 12, but you're actually getting 36. Once you're by baby, go that way. regular roll. So yeah, that's what we're gonna get. We had gotten this one before. It's six equal twenty four mega and it's equal to a roll ten one. But this one you still get more of your, your money. You get more rolls. Did you say we ran out of the plates? Oh yeah. In the garage? Yeah. Might be on sale at Costco. The plates, because these are quite expensive here. These are nine ninety nine, and these only have. They had more. those for one hundred and fifty, Justin. What's wrong? They're the smaller ones, no? One ninety nine for one hundred and fifty. These, are, yeah, these are not dinner. These are like uh. Yeah, yeah, they're, they're the regular dinner, dinner Justin. Are Same they? size. Yeah. You buy this, look, and then buy one refill forever and you just refill it with these and they're clean and everything. You could keep one nice. What, are, what is this? These are clean, disinfecting cleaning wipes, but they're plant-based. Okay. This is pretty cool, Mama. Here. It's cute. Because you can keep one in like every, like in your bath. Huh? Rich people do it. Ma, rich people do it, she said. We didn't end up getting the plates because they were more expensive here. Like Costco. I don't know what's going to get though. How much? Yeah, I saw you. Oh, they're not clean. Yeah, they're not clean. This I do like. And then this one. Yeah, it's alright. I like the champagne looking ones they look so nice like that champagne gold they had a design one that i liked that i saw months ago i don't know if they still have it it was so cute you know, a little bit okay quick at target you can just get a few things we're gonna go to cost for the majority of the other stuff is cheaper mom got shampoo conditioner and body wash got a refill on my toothpaste she got deodorant because she was running low. Got grandma some hair, uh, hair dye because by her in the city she stopped buying it for some reason. Got laundry detergent, the clean kind. Ooh. And we got a thing of clean you. spray, the everything, and then the fabric softener, and then some bouncy. Yeah. Oh, and then. The curl toys that she uses. Oh, Me and mom use a lot of the same products. We like the clean stuff. It's better for your body. Oh, and the playground. Yeah. Yep. Nothing. Have it still have puppy? I got it. Okay, put it back. Here. See you in a second. Alrighty, we finished up at Target. Now we're headed to Costco. See you in a second. Peace. We are now at Costco. I love eggplant products, so they always say my favorite brand. Okay, what's the name? I'm excited. See you in a second.
They have the bread barrel bakery, the women own bakery, real schmuck company in front of those. Nice, you would like this and drive this the Lexus NX450 H Plus all wheel drive. Such a nice color. Wow. Or something. Look at that. We got like a frog put on cake. And not really working out the right? price. And that's okay. At least it'll still be good. That's good here. Oh, 
done. They look so good. And my food is all heated up. Look at that. All nice and hot. I am gonna eat. I'm about to eat my lunch, but I do want to say the zesty sauce is really good, and so is the Hidden Valley Ranch. Burger King has Hidden Valley Ranch, just ask that they'll give it to you instead of their, like, you know, Burger King branded ranch. So, yeah. I'm gonna eat, sing in a bit. We got a new cologne added to my collection. I'm gonna just show you this. This is Versace, and it smells so good. Mom gave it to me. I think she said she got it as a gift, but she never gave it to a person. She's like, you want it? I said, sure. I have so many colognes in this drawer. Which, some of them are empty. I just need to, I hold on to them so I remember which ones I need to rebuy. Like this one, the coach one. It is empty. And I still keep it because it's a cute bottle. You know, and I'm, when I go to the store or whatever, oh, that's the one I need to get, you know, a refill on. This one too is running low. This is Dolce & Gabbana. One. This goes in here. Like that. And we have three up here. These are in a can. I'll show you what they look like. I'll just show you what they all have like the similar shape. It's just the bottle design might be different. So these are what they look like. It's a man. But yeah, these all smell so good, all three. They're just different years. This is 2024, the other one is 2023, and then the one in the back is 2022. Jean-Paul Gaultier. So yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go down and make some dinner. Peace. Making dinner, pork chops and garlic sauce. I think they're ready to eat them pork chops. I put it in some panko bacon and now I'm trying to know. So yeah, when they're done, we'll mix the sauce with the same oil. I make it a little bit of a nice too much, but we want to have oil with all like the bits and pieces of the pork chops. Leave it alone. Exactly. I'm gonna add some butter. Add some butter. Add the shallots and let that go a little bit, and then I'll add the garlic. And a fourth of the white one. Okay. Like that. And I have to keep And I'm gonna add a half a cup of chicken stock. So let's add some chicken stock. I feel like for this and this is pork, probably the pork stock, you have that, but yeah. So, now I'm just gonna let this cheat up a bit. Add a third of a cup of heavy ripping cream. Yep. Maybe a tad more. mustard to dip like french fries or anything especially like yellow mustard but in recipes they call for mustard so that's the only time you'll see me use mustard when I cook and I 
add mustard for taste wise and it actually makes it really good it's gonna be so good with the mustard actually i've never had dijon mustard on its own so i should probably try it it's probably good but just yellow mustard not my thing on like a hot dog nope I'm gonna let this heat up and thicken up and then I'll add pork chops back to it and mix it up and add some salt and pepper and salt. and then some black pepper
Mm -hmm. That's so good. My sauce is so good. This is like my new favorite garlic sauce. Like it actually is so good. I've tried garlic sauce in the past and it didn't taste as good as this one and this one's really good. It's all about practicing more until you get better and this is the best garlic sauce I've ever made. So now I have a good recipe for garlic sauce. I could use it for different things. Just for the pork chops here, I could do it with garlic, you know, for the chicken. I could do it for um, even like uh, what you might call it, steak and stuff. But yeah. Oh, and the potatoes and carrots. They are so darn good. I even put sauce on top. They are good. So I'm going to enjoy my dinner. Catch you all later. Peace. Back dinner was so, so delicious. My sister texted me this. She really enjoyed it too. Now, I am going to try these edible cookie dough bites. They are nut free. They are dairy free, egg free. Um vegan so I'm gonna try them and see if they're any good I don't really make a lot of stuff that's everything free like dairy free and everything because I like you know my stuff to you know taste good I know you can make dairy free stuff taste good so this will be my first time trying something that's dairy free These taste just as good as the one that have like, you know, milk and dairy in it. You know what, actually? You don't need, this doesn't need dairy because it's not like a dessert since it's edible. When I make edible cookie dough at home too, I don't even use an egg because you're making it edible. You don't need the eggs, so it's totally fine. And nuts, you don't really use nuts. I like it. It's birthday cake one, and it's so good. It tastes like what I make here at home. Oh my god, I love it. How many calories are these? 270 calories, serving size 2 ounces, so good. It just doesn't have regular milk, it's probably made with like a soy milk or almond milk maybe. But yeah, it's good, definitely buy it again as a treat. And also, to make cookie dough edible, you have to do heat treat of flour. So you would bake your flour for a bit to, you know, treat it. And then, yeah, that's it. Because I've made edible cookie dough before. But this is quite kind of convenient because you just pick it up at the store and it's already made for you. But I like baking and, you know, desserts and cooking and all that stuff. So, yeah. I'm so good. But anyways, yeah guys, gonna do it for today's video. I want you to give it a like, subscribe, comment, and ding the bell. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Peace out. Mwah.